Hello guys, good evening everybody, good to see you. Hello. Hello Patricia, hello Rufino, Maria Veronica, Tatiana. Hello. Good evening. Hello, good evening Norma, Claudia, Fia. hello. Hello, good evening. Good evening guys, Luis Enrique. Hello. Good evening, hello Alba, Jenny and Albert Franklin. Okay hello. guys, welcome. So I give you a big welcome to Intermediate, right? English Intermediate and congratulations for being here. My name is Joyce and I'm going to be the teacher for this module. So let's just see some of the things that we need to know before starting this level. Okay, give me just a second to share and uh, so I can talk a little bit about this course. Okay, there you have, welcome to English pre-intermediate level. Uh, my name is Teacher Joyce. You can call me Joyce or Teacher Joyce, the way you want. Okay, so let's talk just a little bit about my experience. I am a teacher with more than three, four years teaching English. I have been studying this for a very long time and experience too. So about my experience, I have been working in different places. Uh, here you can see some, and maybe this is my background information, right? Okay, now um, let's talk about Zoom. Vamos a hablar un poquito acerca de Zoom. Esto creo que you see this before, creo que lo vimos antes, but we're going to review, right, some of the aspects that Zoom offers us. So, recordemos que tenemos uh, the button, the silent button, right? Then we have the camera, we have chat, we have the breakout rooms, and, and the ask for help button. Okay, esto, eh, como ya, ya hemos estado en módulos anteriores, ya hemos trabajado a lot with Zoom. Okay, as you know, necesitamos de cumplir eh, estas que nos dice INSAFOR, right? So, tenemos el 80% de su, eh, de su asistencia. Necesitamos tener el, el 80% tanto en tareas y en evaluaciones. También eh, recordarles que eh, las tareas las podemos encontrar en la plataforma. Ya hemos trabajado en la plataforma, right? Creo que la mayoría ya conocemos la plataforma. Eh, si no, pues voy a tomar un tiempo para hablarles un poquito de la plataforma. Ah, todas las tareas y temas eh, se estudian y luego usted hace lo que es un examen, un pequeño quiz. Cada día, right? O si usted lo puede hacer antes, much better. Recordemos que ya estamos en un nivel un poco avanzado, así que the English has to be perfect, right? Or better. So, entonces tenemos otra actividad que son los midterm, que, es, que eso se hace después de dos semanas. Luego tenemos el final exam, que también lo vamos a hacer al final en la última clase, right? Si usted tiene el conocimiento, lo puede hacer antes, no problem. Eh, tenemos eh, también en la plataforma, podemos encontrar las, las actividades, las lecciones que vamos a ir estudiando. Son 60 minutos, recordemos las reglas, right, cámara encendida, you have to turn on your camera. Recordemos escribir el nombre en la parte de Zoom. Right, creo que con eso estamos bastante bien. Ok, estamos bastante bien con los nombres. También eh, la asistencia y la participation, right? Que es lo que nos pide para que usted pueda practicar. Tengamos cuidado también en el caso del sonido. El sonido, tenemos que tener un gran cuidado. Eh, a veces se escucha sonidos que nos pueden distraer, right? Entonces, por eso it's important. Ok, y básicamente esas son las reglas que nos dice Insafor. And uh, no sé si hay dudas here, no sé si hay dudas, or are we okay? No doubts. Creo que hemos trabajado con la plataforma, si no me equivoco, este grupo ya. Okay, so if there are no doubts, guys, 
So let's go. And this is my favorite part because I have talked a lot. Now it's your time for you to speak about yourself. Okay, cada uno va a hablar acerca de eh, your profile, right? Uh, say your name. Um, what do you do? Es lo que usted hace. What do you do? For example, in my case, I am a teacher. Algunos que somos estudiantes también. I am a student. And also, I work for a company. Lo que ustedes hacen. Okay, eh, también quiero que compartamos lo que a usted le gusta. Something you like. Something you like and something you dislike. Something you dislike. Okay, so let's start. And uh, who is volunteer? Volunteers, do I have volunteers to speak? Or do you want me to choose you? O puedo elegirlos? Sí. Uh -huh. Yes? Uh, my name is Amilcar Hernandez. Uh -huh. uh, I like to read. I like to read books, mm -hmm. books in general, uh, religious, theology, mm -hmm. uh, others, other topics, books. Um, I, I am a cell, a cell, uh, a cell book. Mm -hmm. um, I, I dis, I, I dislike. Um, uh, emotion, negative emotion. Mm, negative emotions, yes. Um, is uh, I don't know more. <laughs> no, that was good. That was good. We know <laughs> more about you. For the moment, is is this? <laughs> okay, at the moment, right? That is the information. Okay, that's good. That's very interesting, right? You read books of different yes. topics. Yeah. That's awesome. Yeah. Okay, Rufino, please, can you choose the next person? Please, Rufino. Are you classmate from the previous module? Fueron ustedes estudiantes? Or were you together? Were you together? Or this is the first time? ¿Es esta la primera vez que estamos juntos? Or you study English before, together? No, I, I, uh, I, I see, I see uh, classmates in this class, mm -hmm. and last class in, in, in that class for me is all all new all all new. Okay. Uh, but uh, in this class is I I know I know classmate. Uh, uh, okay, you know them. You know them. Okay, Rufino, choose the next person, please. Let's choose the next person, Rufino. La siguiente persona, Rufino, please. Uh, María Verónica. Okay, María Verónica. So let's go, please. Excuse me. <laughs> so sorry. sorry. No problem. <laughs> okay, go ahead, please, María. Um, my name is Verónica Galvez. Mm -hmm. um, my profession, business administration. Um, I am a student English. Mm -hmm. um, um, sometimes you like um, 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 what? For example, reading books, uh, listen to music. Listen to music. Okay. What type of music do you like, Marta? Um, okay. Uh, romantic in English. Oh, romantic Me music. Gusta you like to sing, okay. That's good to know. Porque vamos a cantar a lot, right? Okay. And you are going to be the first one. <laughs> okay, continue. Um... Read books. Okay, you read books. Okay. And something you dislike? Something you dislike, Maria? 
Mm. Algo que no nos gusta, something you don't like. Um. For example, loud music, música ruidosa, loud music. Uh, that can be one. Or, for example, reggaeton music, maybe. You don't like reggaeton music? What is something you dislike? Reggaeton I... music or... You don't like. Okay. No. You don't like reggaeton music. Okay. I, I, I accept that. Okay. Can you choose the next person, please, Maria? Um, sorry, Patricia Veronica Salazar. Okay, Patricia. Go ahead, please, lady. Thank you, Maria. I am Patricia Salazar de Morales. Mm -hmm. um, I am housewife. Mm -hmm. um, I like read and sing karaoke. Mm -hmm. um, ¿Qué más? <laughs> That's it. <laughs> okay, that's it. That's it. Okay. And what about something you dislike? Um, music, reggaeton. Reggaeton no. music, right? No, no, Me no. neither. <laughs> oh, I share with you the same. <laughs> Sorry for the ones that like. Yes. Okay, Patricia, can you please choose the next person? Uh, Luis Enrique. Luis Enrique, okay, Luis, please introduce yourself. Hi all, hi all. Uh, Manuel, my name is Luis Enriquez. Yeah, uh, I I like uh, make sports in special in especially jogging. Oh, jogging, okay. Uh, yeah, I dislike. Uh, I don't know, maybe Bad Bunny, I, I don't like him. <laughs> okay, Bad Bunny, Bad Bunny, yes, yes, a special person, right? That, that because I like the, the rock music, but uh, I don't like reggaeton, but it's mm -hmm. okay. <laughs> okay, that's good, that's good, right? You like um, a rock music, and but you dislike Bad Bunny. Okay, thank you, Luis. Yeah. Can you choose the next person? Uh, Norma Arbeli Ramos. Okay, let's see. Hello. Hello. Hi, there you are. Go ahead. Hey, my name is Marbelli. Uh, I am a student. Uh, I like to learn new things. Uh, I am very active. I don't like the miss or mess, no sé. Mess. Mess. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, you dislike the mess, right? Yes. Okay, <laughs> I agree with you. Okay, Norma, can you choose the next person, please? Uh, Jenny Sanchez. Jenny Sanchez, are you there, Jenny? Hello, Jenny. Hello, Jenny Sanchez, are you there? Let's see. Hello. Oh, okay, Can there you, you hear? are. Yes, Jenny. Mm -hmm. Hello, my name is Jenny Sanchez. I am a system engineer mm -hmm. and student. I like uh, read books, uh, see movies, Mm -hmm. uh, go for out, bueno, salir a dar una vuelta. Mm -hmm. Outdoors. And <laughs> um, I dislike uh, the people noise. And I like my job because it's a quiet place. <laughs> <laughs> I imagine okay. you don't like people that, that are too loud, right? You like to be in quiet places. Yes. Okay, that's great. Yes. Thank you, Jenny. Can you please choose the next person? Uh, 
Este, permíteme. Uh -huh. Yes, Jenny. Hello. Is here Jenny? No. Se nos fue Jenny. Okay. So let's continue with Tatiana Pleites. Hello, Tatiana. Are you there? Hello, teacher. Hello, Tatiana. Nice to meet you, teacher. Nice to meet you, Tatiana. Tell us more about yourself, please. Okay. I'm Tatiana Jen. I miss, um, I am an English student now, but I'm degree in science of the communication. Mm, um, sometimes I work uh, as a um, graphic designer free freelancer. Okay. And I like to listen to music, I spend time, uh, I spend time with my family and mm -hmm. friends. Mm -hmm. I don't like group music or band music. Okay. What, what is some, oh, you said that you don't like uh, band music. Is that what you mean? Quizás grupera, no sé cómo es que se dice. Oh, maybe group music? Group music. Mm -hmm. Okay, you don't like that. Okay, let's listen another person, Jenny Sanchez. Let's okay, let's go, Jenny. I have uh, some pro technical problems. Okay. Uh, uh, Carla Veronica Ayala. Mm -hmm. Hello. Hi. Hello. Uh, my name is Carla Ayala, uh -huh. and I am a student. I like eat macaroni and spaghetti, uh -huh. <laughs> and I like read book. I prefer read book of romance, uh -huh. and I dislike play soccer. You just like playing soccer, okay, yes. <laughs> okay, playing soccer. Okay, that's good, uh, Carla. Let's listen now to, uh, let's see, a boy. Let's listen a boy now. Um, okay, Rodrigo Chicas, there you are. Can you tell us more about yourself, please, Rodrigo? Hello, good night, everybody. Um, I am Rodrigo Chicas. Now I am a student mm -hmm. and I like so much the cats and, and it's like, I don't know what to say. For example, dogs, do you like dogs? No, not much. Not too much. <laughs> so I dislike dogs. Yeah. Oh, you just like, like dogs. Okay, that is the opposite. Yeah. Okay, thank yes, you, definitely. Rodrigo. Let's listen another person, Gabriela Estefania Cortez. Okay, tell us more about yourself, Daniela. Gabriela. Uh, Gabriela. Uh, well, uh, my name is Gabriela Estefani Cortez. Um, I'm 31 years old and I'm married and I have a daughter. Mm -hmm. And I work some uh, part time, and I like listen to music and watch uh, series. Mm -hmm. And I don't like um, um, a mess. You don't like messy places, okay? Mm -hmm. Yes, and I like to. I like. I like uh, play soccer and I do exercise sometimes. Mm -hmm. And only that. That's it. Okay, thank you, Gabriela. So let's listen another, uh, let's listen one boy more. Fernando Orellana, are you there? Hi, uh, good evening. Yes, here. Okay, Certainly tell us I, more. 
I'm driving now, but I I, I will try to, to share. Okay, my... okay, no problem, no problem. We don't want okay. accidents, right? When no, once no, you are no, but, but but it's not a problem. Okay, <laughs> go okay, ahead. Um, I am Fernando, and I'm 25 years old, and I'm uh, I am a sister engineer, and I like the I like scenes and the front fries. <laughs> And I don't like the noisy people. And I don't know, Some, something, something like that. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Just that. Okay, perfect, Fernando. Thank you so much. Let us know when you are safe. Okay. Okay. Let's listen one more. I don't know if somebody wants to participate. Does this alguien wants to participate? Me teacher. Okay, who says me? Let me just check. Okay, Estrella. Is that your name? Estella. Oh, Estella, Estella. Okay, tell me. Tell us, please. My name is Estella Lara. Mm -hmm. I like eat pizza, see TV, and listen to music, the K pop. And I am work. Mm -hmm. Every day, uh, I dislike it. Fish, pescado. Oh, fish! Really? Do you really know my like? You don't like, okay. <laughs> yes. Creo que solo eso. Okay, that's it. Okay, thank you. Uh, somebody else who wants to share your information. Nice to meet you, Stella. Is there somebody who nice wants to, to meet share? Nice to you too. Thank you. Is there somebody who wants to share the information about yourself? No? No. Okay. 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 Thank you, Estela. Hay alguien más que quiera compartir the information about yourself? Or if not, we can proceed with the lesson, right? No sé si hay dudas acerca de las notas, uh, about the, the quizzes. No sé si hay alguna duda. No, okay, guys. Okay, Patricia Marroquín, do you want to participate? No. Okay, so. Oh. Your name. Uh -huh. I'm sorry. Your name. Oh, my Patricia. name. Oh, I'm sorry. My name is my name is Patricia Amaris Marroquín. Mm -hmm. I am a student. Mm -hmm. I like I like listen to music. Mm -hmm. I dislike mouse. Mm -hmm. And that's it. Okay. You dislike mice. Okay. You dislike mice. I end up using those ratones, right? The mice. Me too. I hate them a lot. I can't see any mice around me because I, I start screaming. Okay, let's listen to Alejandra Magaña. Go ahead, please, Alejandra. Thank you, Patricia. Nice to meet you. Hello. My name is Alejandra Magaña. Mm -hmm. and I like to listen to music, and something I dislike is the seafood. The seafood? Really? Why? If they are healthy? Healthy? Why? <laughs> Why that? I don't, I don't, I don't know why, but I don't, I don't enjoy it when I... Eating. You don't enjoy. Okay, that depends on each one, right? Okay, mm -hmm. nice to meet you, Alejandra. Let's listen now, Maria Luz de Nieto. Um, good night. My name is Maria Luz. Um, I, I work at Fede Credito. Mm -hmm. um, I like listening to music. I dislike. Um, this is washes. Mm -hmm. Oh, dish the washes. <laughs> this the washes. Okay. Nice to meet you. Okay, nice to meet you, Maria. She doesn't like to wash the dishes, right? Yes, that is something that we would avoid. Yes, definitely. But we have to do it anyway. Nice to meet you, Maria. So, is there somebody who wants to participate, guys? Somebody? No. Okay. Let's start then with the class and uh, 
Let me just remind you some of the expressions that we say. For example, sometimes we say good night, right? When estamos en plan to a place. And uh, remember that good night lo vamos a utilizar cuando usted va, eh, por ejemplo, nos estamos despidiendo y se le dice feliz noche. Entonces, ahí se le vamos a utilizar good night, right? Cuando usted se va de un lugar o cuando se le dice a su hijo o a su hija good night, right? Ok, pero cuando entramos a un lugar no utilizamos el good night. Vamos a utilizar el hello, good evening, good afternoon, but good night, no, cuando estamos entrando a un lugar. Ok, good guys, so let's move on to the presentation. Si no hay más dudas, we can start, right? So let's talk about the sports. Sport. And uh, let me know if something uh, you want me to say, something you want me to repeat so I can do it for uh, you to improve your English. Okay, can you help me to read, Emily? Emily, please, can you help me to read the information? Top sports and fitness, please, Emily. Okay. Um, Hello, Emily. Can you hear me, teacher? Yes, now I can. Uh, do people in your country enjoy any of these sport activities? Uh, check the sport or fitness activities you enjoy. Uh, make a list of the activities you do, uh, then compare with the class. Okay, so here we have some of the sports right that we practice maybe that you practice paola maria can you help me to read the sports paola uh, yeah okay help me please uh, basketball mm -hmm. soccer uh, baseball Mm -hmm. And ice hockey. Okay, then we have basketball, then we have the treadmill, then we have the running and jogging, walking, bowling, and weight training. Okay, uh, let's see, Catherine, tell me what sport do you practice? Hello, Catherine. What sport do you practice? No está, Catherine? Okay. Hello. Okay, hello. Tell me, what sport do you practice, Catherine? Um, I practice um, <laughs> soccer. Okay, you practice soccer. Okay. Okay, thank you. And what about you, Sarah Elisa? What sport do you practice? Hello? I sometimes practice walking. Walking, yes. That's very easy and help us a lot, okay? So guys, I want you to write in the chat box the sport that you practice. Can you do that in the chat box, please? What sport do you practice? In my case, sometimes I practice, sometimes I practice uh, running. Okay, can you write it in the chat box? Vamos a escribir la oración in the chat box. What sport do you practice? See in the chat box, please, guys. También, don't forget, no se nos va a olvidar estar en el grupo de WhatsApp. Tenemos el grupo, so please make sure you are in the group, right? Let me just check how many we are. Okay, we are, yes, the ones. Okay, let's see, I practice basketball. Alejandra says she practice walking. Sometimes Patricia practice basketball. And uh, Angela, she practices soccer and walking. I don't like sports, says. I don't like sports, but I practice walking, okay? Sometimes I walk, 
and running. Muy bien. I used to run before. Okay, Jenny. I rarely practice walking. I practice walking. Very good, Rufino. Practice jogging, running and jogging. Luis, yes, right. I remember you say that. Okay, so we have there some of the sports, right? There was a thread mile that is like caminadora, right? Then we have a running and jogging, que es trotar, walking, and bowling. So uh, tell me about this sports, right? What about bike riding? Do you practice bike riding, eh, Carla Veronica? Hello, Carla. Hello, Miss. Hello, tell me, do you do you practice bike riding? No. No? Do you think that it is for children, for teens, for young adults, or for middle aged people? To what age do you think it is this sport? Children. Okay, it is it can be for children. Mm -hmm. What else? Or just that? Mm -hmm. Okay, so what about you, Estela? What about golf? Is that for children, teens, young adults, middle-aged people, or older people? What do you think? Disculpe, no capté. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Para, eh, para quién son estos deportes? Is it for children, for teens, for young adults? Para quién el golf? Golf is mm -hmm. young adult. Young adults, yes, right. It can be all middle-aged people, también, or older people. What about young older people? Too. Older people too, right? What about the next one, eh, Maria Luz Nieto? We have jogging. Um, older people. Okay, jogging, it can be yes, right, for older people. Okay, just that, solamente eso, just that. Um, young adults. And young adults, it can be, right, it can be. What about the martial arts, Rufino? What do you think that sport is for? Martial arts? Mm -hmm. um, teens? For teens, yes, it can be. Teen and uh, some, some children. Some children, most of them, yes. Uh, it's some young adult. Young adults, it can be. It can be. What about Pilates, uh, Norma Marbelli? What do you think that sport is for? Or who can practice that sport? Teens, algunos, creo. It can be teens. Okay. Young, young adults. Young adults. Uh, aún older people. Older people, very good. Okay, it can be. What about soccer? What about soccer, Angela Duran? Who can practice soccer? Children. We have uh, children, right? Teens. Mm -hmm. We have teens. Young adults. Young adults, yes. And maybe middle-aged people. In middle-aged people too. Yes, and older people, maybe they can break their bonds. Okay, what about the next one? Swimming, Alba Saavedra, tell me. Who can practice this sport? Hello, teacher. Mm -hmm. uh, swimming, uh, children, Teens, mm -hmm. young adults, middle age, mm -hmm. um, and older people. And older oh. people too, right? Yes. yes. For sure. Okay, Luis Enrique, tell me about volleyball. Volleyball. Mm -hmm. I think uh, things, things, people, things? young adults, mm -hmm. young adults, mm -hmm. for me only that. That's it. That's right. And what about yoga? Yoga. What about yoga, Emily? Hello. 
Hello, Emily. No. Okay. What about you, Paola Maria? Who can practice practice yoga? Uh, yoga. Yoga is mid-aged people. Middle-aged people, okay. Older people. And older people. And that's it, right? Yoga. Sometimes young adults do things, sometimes, but not too much. Okay, so here we have some of the vocabulary, right, that we can use when we are talking about sport. And also we have some different ages. So let's continue with the topic that it is this uh, presentation of the dialogue. So I want a volunteer. Can you help me? Let's see, uh, Alejandra Magaña, you're going to be Aaron and uh, Andrea is going to be Riley. Are you ready, ladies? Okay. You have a lot of energy, Riley. Do you exercise a lot? Well, I get up early and run on the No puedo ver ahí. There. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Treadmill for mm -hmm. an hour every day. Seriously? Sure, and I do wait left time. How often do you lift weight? I usually do it about three times a week. What about you? Oh, I hardly ever exercise. I usually just watch TV or listen to music in my free time. I guess I'm a real couch potato. potato. Okay, there you have, right? Some of the words we have, for example, uh, lifting, right? Mantamiento de pesas, lifting. And uh, then we have a couch potato. Son las personas que solo pasan in the, in the sofa, right? All the time. So, uh, questions about a word? Questions about the word? Treadmill. No? What is treadmill? A treadmill? It is uh, when you are running in the gym, you are running in the treadmill, like this. Let me just show you la corredora, right? It's like this one. This one, right, the treadmill. Okay, uh, any other? Okay, I guess we are okay with this part. So let's talk about the, the topic for today that is going to be the how often. Okay, how often we use it to say que tan seguido we do an activity. Uh, how often do you do exercise? And uh, we have the expression every day, once a week, twice a month, three times a year, often, much, or usually. Okay, usually and sometimes podemos utilizarlo at the beginning of the sentence or we can use it um, sometimes at the end, right? But usually we, uh, it is at the beginning of the sentence. Okay, so let's see uh, what about with the yes, no question. Tenemos el, we have the ever, do you ever, alguna vez, right? Uh, watch TV. Tenemos the expression, some expression often, sometimes, hardly ever, casi nunca, or never. Okay, tenemos also, for example, this section. What is time expression? Algo que usted siempre hace, it is going to be always right. Almost always, casi nunca, usually, it is less often too, sometimes, hardly ever, and almost never. Okay, um, I don't know if you have questions, guys, about uh, these time expressions. Questions? What is the position? Usually, these ones, usualmente these ones, we are going to use them uh, between the subject and the verb, right? That is something that we have to keep in mind. Often, for example, sometimes, and so on. This is, that is very important. Do you have any questions? Do you have any doubts about the, the topic? 
No questions? Okay, no good. Question. Okay, we are okay then. Okay, let's try to do some exercise. Vamos a hacer entonces this exercise. It says, put the verbs, put the adverbs in the correct place. Sometimes there is more than one correct answer. Then practice with a partner. Tenemos eh, the adverb ever. Donde podríamos, where can we add ever? Let's see. Norma, tell me, ¿dónde podemos agregar ever? Where can we add ever in la primera, in the first question? I play ever. This one. In this one. Do you play sports? Oh, okay. Do you play sports? Do you okay. ever? Do you ever? Yes, right. Yeah, okay. Do, Do you, you ever, ever play sports? Play sports. Okay, what about letter B, Angela? Sure. ¿Cómo nos quedaría? What could be the, the response using twice a week? Sure. I play soccer twice a week. Yes, right. I play soccer. Sorry, Angela. I'm going to... Let's listen now, Angela. Okay, no problem. Perdón. No problem, no problem. Perdón. Let's go with number two, Angela, please. What do you usually do on Saturday mornings? Your microphone, I think, is. Mm -hmm. Is. What do you usually do? Okay. On morning. Very good. And what about almost always? Um. And nothing much. I sleep on ice. Mm -hmm. Till not almost always. I sleep until now, until noon. Okay, almost always. Okay, let's see what is the position of almost always. They go where? In the middle of the, the subject and, and verb. the verb. So, what is going to be the position? Nothing much. I almost always sleep until noon. Okay, perfect. Thank you. So, let's go with number three. Uh, Rufino, please. Do you lift weights at the gym? Uh, do you do you do you often lift weights at the gym? Mm -hmm. um, no. I I hardly ever lift weight. Very good, yes. So it's going to be I, right, I'm sorry. It's going to be right. Then we have the other one that goes here. Okay, the next one. Uh, can you help me, Tatiana, number four? Do you always yeah. mm -hmm. exercise on Saturday, on Sunday? Yeah. Between verb B and main verb? Yeah. And the other one, please. No, no I never exercise on Sunday. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Let's continue with Jenny. Number five, Jenny, please. What do you what do you usually? No. What do you do usually mm -hmm. after class? Okay, you said it perfectly the first time. What do you usually do? Yes. After class. Mm -hmm. Continue, letter B. I, I go about, about three times a week out with my classmates. Okay, I go out with my friends about three times a week. Or we can say two about three times a week. I go out with my classmate. Both ways are okay. Okay, thank you, Jenny. Let's listen now to Albert Franklin. Number six, please, Albert. Hello, Albert, are you there? Oh. Let's see, Alejandra Magaña, number seven. 
Okay, Franklin. Go to the movies. Okay. Yes. I go once a week to the movies. Mm -hmm. Or I once a week, I go to movies too, right? It can be. Okay, thank you, Alejandra. Let's listen now, number eight. Can you help me? Let's see, Veronica Milagro. Can you help me with number eight? Okay, All right, Franklin. Hello, Veronica. No, Nasta is not here, Veronica. Okay, can you help me? Uh, Estella, please, number eight. Do you sometimes walk to school? Do you sometimes, okay, walk to school? And the answer. Sure, I walk to school. No, wait a minute. Sure, I walk. I, five day. No, wait a minute. I walk five days a week to a school. It can be, right? It can be, I walk to school or five days a week. It can be. Okay, so guys, questions about the position, right? That is very important, the position of the adverbs. Usually, they go between the subject and the main verb. Okay, no questions? No. Okay, so let's practice them. Vamos a practicar. We are going to practice. This is something that um, you have studied before about the simple present, but it is good to keep in mind the rules. Tenemos el how often, right? Recordemos que el do. It goes with I, you, we, y they. And uh, does goes with he, she, and meet. We have the expressions and uh, on the position, right, of the verbs. Okay, let's see, Norma, tell me, how often, how often do you practice exercise? How often do you practice exercise? Um, I practice exercise, um, Every weekend? Every weekend, right? Okay. okay. Thank you, Norma. Angela, tell me, how often does Norma practice exercise? Norma practice exercise every weekend. Okay. What about you, Angela? How often do you practice exercise? Once in a while. <laughs> Once in a while. Okay. Like almost never, right? Okay, thank you, Angela. Okay, tell me, Maria, Veronica, how often does Angela Duran practice exercise? How often does mm -hmm. how often does Angela practice? Practices? How often does Angela? Mm -hmm. Okay, very good. She practices once in a while. Um, okay. Okay, thank how you. Often, how Sorry. often does Angela, she practice on saying a uh, while. Okay, okay, Maria. Okay, it's good. Thank you, thank you. Okay, so guys, let's continue and uh, recordemos que para hacer preguntas, en el caso que estemos utilizando how often, y estemos hablando de he, she, or it, vamos a utilizar el does, right? And uh, el verbo tiene que estar in the normal way. Siempre tengamos cuidado cuando estemos hablando de he, she, and it to pronounce the sound of the S, right? She practices once a while. She watches TV once in a while. Okay, no sé si hay dudas or questions about the form, right? Questions? No questions? Okay, good. Now you're going to be practicing in groups, right? Vamos a practicar in groups and you're going to create questions based on the subject 
end of the verb. Ok, ¿qué vamos a hacer? We are going to create. Vamos a crear questions using how often. And uh, uh, we are going to ask this question to your partners usando the adverse of frequency. Ok, let's go to the breakout rooms and then you are going to present the information here in the class. We're going to have five minutes for finishing that task. So let's go to the breakout rooms and uh, practice. Questions about going, about the activity? No questions? No, okay, so let's go to the breakout rooms and uh, there you're going to be practicing with your partners. Remember to create questions, pay attention to the subjects and verbs. I'm going to be sharing to the information in the WhatsApp group. Hello, uh, Veronica, Patricia, what happened? Hello, Patricia, Cristela, what happened, ladies? A mí me sacó del, del grupo, okay. de la reunión. Let me see if I can send it to another group. Okay, let's try uh, now, Cristela, please. Let's try it. Patricia, I think she has some issues.
months, una vez al mes. Hello guys, do you have questions? What do you think? Questions or are we okay? Mm, no questions. No questions, okay. I'll let you mm, work. Thank guys. you. Okay. Oh, oh sorry, Patricia. Hello. Hello, Patricia. Can you hear me? Patricia, can you hear me? Hello. Hello. Hello, yes. Okay, so we are working maybe because of the time. Did you check the WhatsApp and complete the exercise? And let me know if you have questions. Okay. Okay, let's do it, please. Okay. Hello, Angela, do you have questions or are we okay? Uh, mi compañera se salió. Okay, se no problem. Tenía, que tenía problemas de conectividad. Dijo. Okay, okay. Did you finish the exercise? Um, yes. Yes, I'm okay. Finished. Okay, so let's check the exercise. Okay. Okay, can you start, can you tell me? of the first one, Norma, please. Uh, how often do you drink soda? Mm -hmm. uh, hardly, hardly ever. Okay, I hardly ever drink soda, okay. Thank you, Norma. Okay, drink thank soda. you. Uh, the next one, number three, uh, Gabriela, please. Gabriela, number three. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, how often do you how often uh, do you eat breakfast alone? Mm -hmm. Um Gabriela. Mm -hmm. uh, me. Uh, I take breakfast uh, alone uh, sometime. Okay, sometimes, okay, sometimes I eat breakfast alone, right? I eat breakfast alone. Okay, very good, Gabriela. What about number three? Como nos quedó? Estela, please, number three. Number three. Mm -hmm. Who often do breakfast alone? No, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, number four. I'm sorry, number four. Oh, number mm -hmm. four. Mm -hmm. Who often your family go out and okay. a restaurant? How often your family go out? Your family go out to, to a restaurant. Something is missing there. What is missing? I cannot say that something is missing. What could be something very important? Is the is the a pregunta? Yes, mm -hmm. but something, algo nos hace falta, something is missing here. What is it? Sería el, that's right. 
How often does your family go out to a nice restaurant? Okay, and what is the answer? What, what do you have as an answer? Mm -hmm. Estela? Sounds what is. Mm -hmm. In my case, I put never. Never. My family never goes. Oye, eso estoy perdida. Permítame, permítame, permítame. No, entonces en la número four, en la yes. cuatro, mm -hmm. en mi caso sería every week, todas las semanas, los fines de semana. Okay, my family, my family goes out, goes out to a nice restaurant. A nice restaurant. Once every week, right? Every week. Okay, very good. Thank you, Estela. So um, let me check the time. Oh, yes, it's time. And uh, I don't want to take too much time from you guys. So question five and six, you can share it in the chat box in WhatsApp. And if there are no questions, guys, I will say goodbye. And thank you so much for coming. Okay, guys, have a good night. Teacher. Yes, tell me, Estela. Good night. Bye. Good night. Good night. Bye. Good night. Eh, no, no, no. Eh, oh, sorry. Nos puede compartir you? la presentación en WhatsApp. Ok. Um, Por favor. Fíjese que le puedo, le puedo compartir las imágenes, que es todo un. O sea, están todas las clases ahí. Entonces le puedo compartir las imágenes. Listo. Okay. okay, perfect. Estamos todos en el grupo de WhatsApp. Oh, bueno. Espero que sí. Si no se los compartí, le compartí el enlace en el grupo, en este de Zoom, en el chat de Zoom. Okay. Ahí también está. Ok. 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 See you guys. Have a good bye. Night. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. bye, -bye. bye, -bye. Good night. Thank you. Bye, guys. See you guys. Have a good night. Bye, bye, ladies.